All right, guys, let's see how uh, those practice problems went for you. So um, on the first set, where you had to convert 21 and 5 tenths inches to centimeters, you can see how I did my conversions here. Um, I multiplied 21 and 5 tenths inches by 2.54 centimeters over 1 inch, and my answer was 5 and 61 hundredths centimeters. The next one here. My conversion factor was 3.785 liters over one gallon. And when I did that multiplication, I got 19.0007 liters. Next one, my conversion factor was 1.609 kilometers over one mile. And when I multiplied that out, I got 2.974 kilometers. Next one, my conversion factor for 83 liters to gallons was 0.264 gallons over one liter. And I multiplied that out, I got 21 and 912 thousandths gallons. Next one, 9 and 66 hundredths. My conversion factor was 62 hundredths miles over one kilometer. And I multiplied that out, I got 5. 0.9892 miles. And down here, 1 and 13 hundredths kilograms converted to pounds. My conversion factor was 2 and 2 tenths pounds over 1 kilogram. When I multiplied that out, I got 2 and 486 thousandths pounds. All right, over here, 5 and 6 tenths meters converted to inches. My conversion factor was 39.37 inches is 1 meter. Multiplied that out, I got 220 and 472 uh, thousandths inches. This is the one we did. I just put in the word meters so that you wouldn't confuse that with miles. And so this one was the hardest. I've got 10 and 3 tenths inches. I made that a fraction over 1. The conversion factor that I know is that 1 meter is 39 and 37 hundredths inches. The inches need to be opposite each other, so those cancel out. Um, when I multiply 10.3 times 1 meter, I get 10.3 meters. And 1 times 39.37 is 39.37. I just do that division, 10.3 divided by 39.37. And then this is rounded. I came up with a very long number in my calculator, and I rounded it to the hundredths place. So, I'm sorry, the thousandths place. So 0.262, 262 thousandths meters. All right, hope that went well for you. We'll do a little more practice in class. See you then.